Hello everyone. Hope you all are doing good. Today, I'm going to explain data sets in reports. How to use data sets and uh, why we use data set in reports. Okay, let's see. So log into your instance and uh, go to reports. Okay, go to reports. Let's uh, create a new report. Okay, let's see how we can create a data sets or something. Okay, create a new. Okay, so I want to see. Uh, I want to. I want to see. For example, I want to see uh, incident, problem, change, all active incidents, all active problems, all active change in one report so so how i will create it using data sets okay let's see okay active inc pb chg okay so i want to see active okay so table for example i will put table as incident okay so i will select only incident Okay, and then uh, type okay bar. Okay, so for example, if I select a list view, okay, I will explain you later. Okay, so configure okay, anything. Okay, let's run. So you, you are getting uh, true and false group by active. Okay, so uh okay so what i will do is i will add a condition active is true run okay so i can see only incidents with 41 active true incidents okay so now how i will add proactive problems and active change okay for that let's save the report okay Let's save the report and the, in the tree, okay, click on this one. So here you have add data set, okay. So I will add it, okay, click on add. Okay, data set name is active BB problem, okay. So here I will go problem table, problem table, okay. Okay, so I will add condition active is true and run. So I will get active true. Save data set. Okay, so then if you go here, I will see incident and active PB. Okay, here what is the name we give? Okay, so all that it will come. Okay. So these two are in same color, okay? I want to uh, I want to make other color, okay? For our active problems, okay? So let's go to active problem, okay? Let's active or we will say problem, okay? For our paper, okay? And style use color, use one color, okay? So which color we will add for problem? Um, who will add? For example, only okay. And save data set. Okay, so it is changed for both, but um, here we will add. Uh, the blue one okay and run okay and save it okay now we will add and the data set called change change table we have change the change underscore request okay here also active is true. Okay. And change the style to 
some other color. Let's add this one. And save data set. And you can see. OK. And you can write this as uh, a data set name also. OK, you can write anything. So you can see, you can see active incidents, active problems, active change in one report. OK, so that is how we will create a data set and that is how we use data sets. OK, so I hope you understand this thing. OK, yeah, thank you. Please do subscribe to get alerts for upcoming videos. Hope you will enjoy and learn service now. Thank you very much for your time.